One of the odd effects of this virus has been that my world has shrunk, but the people right around me have become more important. We have a neighborhood happy hour every Saturday, and we sit six feet apart in a big circle, and uh, I thought, well, you know what, let's see if we can do something together as a neighborhood. And at one of the meetings, I thought, I'm gonna say I wanna build a big piece of art, and if anyone says no, okay, nope. And if everyone says yes, I'm in. We talked about it, everyone said that's a great idea, let's build it, and we off we were, off to the races. I've worked on a lot of collaborative art. I love working on collaborative art. With social distancing, you can't sit in the same room and collaborate. You can't sit and look at each other's work. You can't, you know, you can't be next to each other. So the question on this collaborative art was, how do we create segments of the art, pieces of the art that we can farm out, but it all comes together? And I came up with the mosaics. In particular, I wanted neighborhood kids to build mosaics for the foot of the pillars for the sculpture. I wanted kids to do something besides look at a screen. I wanted kids to enjoy the physical world. This is amazing. I'm a strong believer in collaborative art built by communities for communities that recognizes human need in struggle.